What's going on my dudes? One Step here with the Ultimate Beginner's Guide to Star-Lord and Marvel Rivals. Giving you some tips and tricks on how to play Star-Lord, some best strategies to be aware of, and of course some fun team comps that you can use today. Subscribe here for more Marvel Rivals content and let's talk about Star-Lord. Honestly, one of my favorite DPS characters so far. This guy just absolutely deletes people. So let me quickly go over all of his moves, his abilities, so that you understand what's going on in the fight. And I'll even showcase what they're doing in an actual fight. His standard attack is, yeah, the uh, double pistol machine guns we basically got. And because most characters of the roster have less than 275 health, yeah, one full clip headshot will literally delete them. Honestly, against the right character, even body shots do that exact same thing. Now keep in mind, the spread does go a bit further the more you shoot. So with that being said, he's a very up close and personal kind of character. Like we're at the 25 meter range right here and yeah, we can hit him, but uh, the damage is a bit lower. And with that spread, a couple of those bullets might be missing, especially because you got to keep moving. Otherwise you're going to die really fast. Now to break him down, simple and easy, that is Star. Lord. He's got really good mobility though, not by himself walking. With rocket propulsion, we had that meter on the side there. As you see, it's going up. We can use rockets and just fly away basically and ascend and then cancel it, drop in, get in our opponent's face, bop, they're dead. And then use that same thing to get away really quick. And then we have blaster barrage, which is like this giant, just frenzy of shots going every which way direction. And as long as the opponent is relatively low on their health, you can get a lot of good kills with this move alone. If they're a couple out, go there, they're dead, and then his guy might be dead. If not, boom, now he is. So what I like to do with those moves is rocket propulsion into like a group of enemies and then immediately just frenzy it and just go crazy on them and then rocket propulsion out of there. Like I got to get in and then get out. Now that's your biggest multi-enemy hitting move. A great thing to do that I like to do is using stellar shift, which is actually this uh, leaping movement here that reloads your guns for you. You can empty your clip, jump, and empty it again to reload it. And then use another one of your charges, jump out of there, then rocket propel away. Uh, that's a really good like getaway tool. So you unload your clip, you jump away, unload your clip, jump away, do you unload your clip again, and then rocket propel out of there. He is very oh mobile in that Here aspect. He can really do the damage. You get in their opponent's face, jump away, oh, reload, unload enemy. your clip again, jump away, reload, unload your clip again. As you can see, he's a very high damaging character. But he's kind of like a glass cannon, because yeah, he can put out that damage, but he's going to die pretty fast. Keep in mind, he does have a melee attack, uh, but as you can see here, it's not great like at all. If you're this close, you might as well just spray and pray. I haven't really run into a reason where I would be doing melee attacks over my guns, but he does have melee attacks. Now let's talk about Star-Lord's ultimate oh, attack, which is one of my favorites in the happy. entire game. You go free flight mode, you lock on your enemies, and you just unload your clips, absolutely just erasing these people from the game. You think I'm joking? Watch this. Here we go. Delete that. Delete them. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Auto locking on everybody here. Like you can take out multiple people with this ult alone. Just go absolutely crazy. Auto lock, auto lock, reload, auto lock, auto lock. They're, they're, they're done. Oh, what's that? More enemies. His ult is uh, is pretty crazy. It's obviously best to use with like, a group of enemies. So yeah, that's Star-Lord in a, in, a, in a really nutshell. Now, what about team comps, team up, stuff like that? Who do you want to be playing with? Well, first and foremost, I recommend Adam Warlock. He's a great healer, first of all. Probably one of the best. But also, he's got a team up ability with Star-Lord and Mantis. But when you have Adam Perfection Warlock on your team and then Star-Lord dies, Star-Lord will then enter a cocoon state. So Mantis, as you can see here, they will both enter a cocoon state, thus reviving themselves. They can fly away and get you a really good save point and then cocoon themselves and revive themselves because of Adam Warlock being on the team. So to show you from this point of view, we're Star-Lord and we have Adam Warlock on our team and we are just getting in there and, and we're doing some good stuff, but then we die. Like, oh no, we're dead, kid. We can like fly away, ascend, get to a really good spot, whether it be high in the air or behind a wall, wherever you want to go. Uh, then cocoon yourself and this is where you revive yourself back to full health and just get right back in the fight take out the person that took you out yeah if you galactic bot that's my first choice because you basically get two lives and that's just that's just almost it's almost too good to pass up so if you're playing star lord you want to tell your friends to be playing adam awesome team up but who else is good because you're the one that's getting up close and personal with your opponents you might want to have one of your teammates kind of pinging them from afar helping you get those one clip kills characters that stay back and do that exact thing like hawkeye iron man even no more is a really good choice adam like i said is a given choice Cloak and Dagger can give you invulnerability, just helping your ult out, getting close and personal without the fear of dying. Really good choice for a team up here as well. And I like to stand behind Magneto's uh, shield, projectile shield, while I'm sitting the projectiles, because then I live longer and they're taking all of my bullets while I'm taking none of theirs. There's a lot of really good team up choices. These are just my personal favorites. So how does this awesome, damaging, high mobility character look in a game? Well, let's get in one and I'll show you. We'll put everything we learned here into practice. Have you subscribed yet? I sure hope so. 
so. Star Lord's gonna show you what it means to be a DPS of a team. With Star Lord, you should probably never stop moving. We're just gonna be really annoying to our opponents, honestly. We can basically be the first ones to our objective here by just flying there. Oh, shoot, they're right here. Okay, L1, get out of there. Frenzy. Okay, yep. We did some damage. We got out of there fast, though. We get out of there fast again. Okay, found a new spot. Uh, let's go. Uh, let's go up there if we can. Flank it from behind. Let's get rid of that. Let's get. Rid of oh shoot. Okay. Get rid of that too. Oh, got projectile. Okay, now. Um, side lock. You got to get out of here. Uh, how many people are in here with me? Nobody. And then we're gonna jump in. Jump. Reload. Jump out. Okay. Then we're gonna get out of there. Shoot. Do some damage. My needle is gonna be annoying us here. We're gonna jump in, uh, do L1. Hopefully get some kills. Ah. Yeah, that's the risk of trying to do that is if there's multiple people and they're just uh, kind of focusing you, you're gonna die. Get back in the fight really fast like this. Jump, reload, unload the clip. Jump, reload, unload the clip. Let's get to the objective, shall we please? Perfect. We can be the first one taking this objective as we are pretty dang mobile and fast. Wolverine, what are you doing fam? Oh my gosh. Where's he at, where's he at? Jump in, reload, turn around. Oh, they're coming from this way. Jump, reload, do it again. Oh, very nice, Magneto. Jump, just for that mobility. We didn't need to reload, but we need that mobility real quick. Get behind Venom. He's gonna be taking the heat for us, but we just get behind him, uh, just jumping our mags. Also move this while we can. Stay behind everybody again. We want them to take the heat, the tanks especially. We're gonna get actually up here on the high ground and see what we can do. Uh, see if we can flank our opponents from up here. Anybody up there with me? No, okay. Oh, we sure can't. Oh, that's my, that's our teammate. Hello. Scar the Witch, you are going to be dead to me. You are a problem. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, Magneto's there too. Help me, Venom. Help me, Venom, please. We got to get out of here. Woo. Jump up. Uh, let's do the potion here. Anyways, uh, there's no healing in here. Dang it, dude. Born again. Thank you, Jeff. He's healing us. Oh, Dr. Strange, you're dead, bro. You're dead. Once, once that's gone, you're dead. Move forward. Take care of this Wolverine. Jump, reload. Take care of him. Jump, reload. Perfect. Look at that Loki. Yep, absolutely. Just unload from back here. We have decent accuracy even from back here. We, why, why are we shooting him? He's got the, the shield. Okay, there we go. Deleted. Repulse over here. Get up. Oh, love to see that behind them. Oh, dude. Scarlet Witch is going to just delete us. We're not going to fight that because she can, I feel like, delete us faster. Which is super come on guys please oh we jumped in uh while we're loading spider-man eh we're gonna we're gonna get in there and do uh, our frenzy there's one perfect perfect and then we're gonna repulse out of there that's kind of the shot i'm talking about you want to get in there frenzy then get out that's kind of what you want to do there stay on the objective with mr punisher here the america's got a shield up we're not gonna fight that oh now we will jump away did not need the reload, but we needed the... Uh, okay, yeah, she, he got wrecked, dude. Did not need that reload. We wanted the mobility there as well. Scarlet Witch, we have more range than she does. That's kind of the key there, is you want to stay away out of her range. And then take care of her. Yep, exactly. Didn't need to use the uh, quick reload there. We are just moving this payload along, man. You'll love to see it. Let's get in there. Let's go up here and uh, catch up from behind, shall we? We also have our ult, so we'll probably use our ult here while they're not expecting it. We're gonna watch after that Scarlet Witch. She's gonna delete us. Didn't wanna waste my ult on her. Who's uh, on our uh, payload here? Venom? Yeah, Venom's gone. Love to see that. I thought it was gonna be my ult, but I'll probably save it for a minute while I'm on the payload because we can just clear oh, out everybody here. Like right now, let's do it. I am ready to let's just do some damage. Even if we can't kill anybody, let's just do the damage we can. Oh, Spider-Man got rid of us. Nope. Rid of him, rid of him. Luna's gotta go. Oh gosh, we are. We gotta go. Oh, frenzy, 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 frenzy. Last, last call. We're probably gonna die. We're probably gonna die. Oh, no, we're not gonna die. I was like, you know what, frenzy, get some last minute damage off and it's fine, it's fine. Oh, no, reload, reload, reload. Oh, he thought he had us too. <laughs> you jump in there, reload. Get rid of the last Spider-Man, then you win, maybe. This is cake, this is... Stood no chance, man, stood no chance. That is Star-Lord right there for you, dude. Oh, victory, cake money. With all that being said, my dudes, let me know your thoughts down below on Star Lord and Marvel Rivals. Do you like him? Do you hate him? Is he your main? Let me know your thoughts down below. Subscribe here for more content. Take it one step at a time and go ahead and click into these videos next for more Marvel Rivals news, guides, reactions, and more.